OK, listen up. As you know, we're on amber alert with a suspected red as early as tomorrow morning. Now, obviously, that's unnerving. We don't know what to expect until it actually happens. But what we do know is that for us, at least, things are going to get pretty rough. Now, we're already operating at full capacity, so we're going to need to get creative. Now, Dr Adams has already uh, converted the upper and lower hallways into holding bays. And whilst there's still no cure, we do know that high doses of epitriptan do buy the afflicted another 24 hours. So I've distributed all of our stock to all of the holding bays and the treatment areas on each floor. But once it's gone, it's gone. So use your judgment and treat wisely. Now, we can expect looting. So watch your backs. See if you can get everyone to work in pairs and whatever they do, do not take off their gloves. Any dead, take straight to the, the west side incinerator. No arguments, Jack. Questions? Good. Now let's get going. He's an elusive spirit. A wood sprite. A shadow. There was only ever one experience with Dave. No matter where we were or what we were doing, it was the same. A suspended reality. A heightened state of living. A rumping downhill run. I stand close and everything rises within me. My breath activates, gasps into life like some old machine that's been lying dormant in some dark forgotten room. My curtains flung open, windows too, and air, real life-giving fresh air, rushes into every part of my body. He's life. He's honest. He's fiercely loyal. I like the fact it's got PayPal on it. I'm used to them dealing with my money online, so that's good. Um, it's just more convenient, really, isn't it? I'm busy juggling with things, so anything that makes my life easier, well, it's a no-brainer as far as I'm concerned. Yeah.